Good morning. It is Friday, May 31st, 2024. I'm back here for Daily Shakeup number 901. And today I want to talk about fear, something that we all experience. Yes, it's true. We all experience it. Let's just face it. Fear is natural. And when we pretend it doesn't exist, fear wins. We think fear wins because we let it win. In some cases, true. But when we pretend we don't have fear, that's an internal lie that trips us up more often than anything else. So for those people who walk around saying, I am fearless, let's get real. Start telling the truth. But here's what I want to talk about with fear today. Where does fear start? Not where do we feel it, because we usually feel it in our body, or especially that kind of fight or flight thing or freeze. We feel that in our body, but where does it start? It starts in our brain. It starts in a part of our brain called the amygdala. We all know that, right? We've heard of the phrase, the lizard brain. It's, and, you know, we've got to move that, you know, we immediate respond to things. And often we take action based upon that immediate fear response. And often it's subtle. It's unconscious. It's not, oh, I see the lion. Yes, I'm afraid. No, it's these subtle little things like fear to make change, fear to make risk, fear to have a take risk, fear to have a conversation, fear to just try things. All these sources of fear are right here. They're right here. So here's my challenge to you. If we know this. Why is it when we're facing what we perceive to be a big decision, do we say, I need to go think about it? Well, think about that. Here I am facing something that's big in my mind, or even if it's small, that requires change or discomfort. We know most of us resist discomfort. That resistance is a form of fear. So here I am facing potential discomfort, unsettlement, so there's going to likely be some fear, even if I'm not sure what it is. That's the key. You don't have to know what it is. So there's fear in my brain. Let me go think about it here. Do you see the problem? We are going to the place where our fear lives to make decisions, not, really, not realizing often that we are actually making the decision from a place of fear because we chose to go here with it. Now, does that mean you don't think about things? No. But what it does mean is don't get stuck in your head thinking about it. Sometimes we have to intuit about it. We have to feel about it. We have to go to our other senses. We got to go to our gut. We got to go to our heart. And yeah, a lot of times these are going to tell us things and our head's going to say to the contrary. Why? Because this is the source of fear. It exists to protect us. It's a good thing to have that protection, but it's a bad thing when we allow that protection to be our way of life. So think about that in your next conversation, your next decision. Don't overthink it, because if you're overthinking it, you're overfearing it. Have a great day and a great weekend.